The following video is sponsored by NBA Live Mobile Coins.com. If you're looking for NBA Live Mobile Coins, be sure to check out NBA Live Mobile Coins.com and use code Clickwood at checkout for a 10% discount. Hey, what is up, guys? Clickwood here, back again with another NBA Live mobile video. Guys, today we have a bunch of new stuff that's added into the game. It is Final Four weekend, which means, yes, we are finally getting some upgrades for those players that we've been saving and holding on to. Your Curry, your Leitner, your Ewing, and, of course, your Carmelo Anthony. But we also actually have some new legends in the game as well. Um, these cards are Bill Walton and Jerry Lucas. It looks like you have to do some sets to complete them, um, or live events to, to get um, trophies and things like that but one thing that you can also do it appears is open up uh, in packs you can get a Jerry Lucas legend so that's pretty cool this card looks like it's a 95 overall which looks pretty nice so um, yeah I mean we'll definitely see if we can pull that but what I really wanted to focus on today was those final four players guys I'm gonna go in here and show you guys exactly what's going on with the mobile madness sets um, if you guys haven't been paying close attention, it's been tough to get these brackets. However, um, and, and actually in yesterday's video, I actually did a video talking about that you pretty much have to spend money to get to be able to even complete these sets, which is frustrating. But um, what's kind of cool is that today, or actually it was yesterday after I made the video, oddly enough, they added in a new set that you can actually complete every three hours to get yourself two of the mobile madness brackets now i've been trying to complete them on the three hour mark every time if i can because i want to get as many of these in as possible because it is difficult as hell to get these freaking brackets man and you, you need 20 of them or uh, is it 25 i'm trying to remember let me quick look here so i don't quote myself or put the wrong thing in this video here uh yeah you need 25 of them to complete the player so that is pretty frustrating uh it's gonna be damn expensive to complete any of these players uh including like the patrick ewing here now unfortunately we don't even necessarily know if there's going to be a championship round of these players um, it does say the final round, so there is, a, I mean, we have to assume that you're going to be able to put, like, your, your 94 in here and complete this to get an upgraded version, but we don't really know exactly what's going to happen. We don't know if that final one is going to be able to be auctioned. Like, we have no idea what's going to happen with those. So, uh, right now I have enough of the trophies to complete Patrick Ewing and Christian Leitner, or, of course, I could do Carmelo instead of Leitner. I don't know. I haven't decided yet what I'm going to do, but I do need to get some of these final four players. Now, um... Um, in addition to that, uh, let's let's talk a little bit about, like I said, those brackets. Um, you can obviously go through here and do these uh, things every two hours, every three hours. So keep that in mind. The other thing, um, on the actual day of the game, you're going to be able to go in here and get the, the thing that you can get for one additional every day. So that's a good thing. But the last thing that you're going to be able to do to get more of the brackets is still complete some of those achievements if you haven't completed them yet. And I haven't completed all of mine yet. Yet. So let's click on, uh, let's see here, Mobile Madness. So I'm one set away from getting myself an additional seven brackets. Um, I just need to complete one more set. So once I complete the Leitner or the Ewing or whoever I want to do, that will be uh, what I'll do for that. Um, you also can get five more, I can get five more if I complete more of these live events. Now, unfortunately, I don't know if I'm going to be able to complete enough live events because they're only doing like five. So I don't know if I'll actually be able to complete them unless they do the final one. Um, if they have one in like the championship round, then possibly I'd be able to complete that. But that's only going to give me 12. So I do need more of the brackets still, man. Like I definitely need more of the brackets. Um, if you guys didn't see, they did also add the... Um, the set in here that you can do to get yourself 50 of the brackets um this one i actually already completed so if you guys haven't completed these the 15 one uh, or actually let's see here the round of 64 you could get a, a 10 pack of brackets the round of 32 you can get a 15 round of, uh, uh, pack of brackets 16 was a 25 pack and then um there was a 50 one where is it uh let's see here oh 30 35 i don't know why i thought it was 50 Oh, that was round of eight. Okay, so that's why. All right, so that one I did complete, and then there we go. There's the 50. Okay, so round of four, there was the 50, and I did already complete this. You needed an, an elite player from the round of eight to do that. Um, so, yeah, I mean, these are kind of the ways that you have to do it. You basically have to do all this stuff, and you have to do all the live events. So uh, it can be very, very expensive to complete this. Now, thankfully, these sets here, you just need to put any gold players in. 
So like you can put random players. It doesn't have to be a uh, round of 64 golds. You can do whatever you want with them. Um, and, and again, every three hours, this thing will refresh for you to be able to do it again. So you want to kind of maybe even set a reminder for on your phone or something like that to go on there and complete it because that's going to be, in my opinion, one of the best ways to do it. Uh, if you stay on top of it, you're going to be able to get, like I said, um, two every three hours. So if you did it, you would be able to get 16 a day, essentially. Is that right? Yeah. Yeah, 16 a day. So uh, keep that in mind, guys, because that's a good way to be able to potentially complete these things as well, as long as this stays in the game. And it looks like it is going to stay in the game. We don't know for sure, but that's what I'm assuming. So uh, anyway, guys, that is kind of a quick update on that. Now, you can get these Elite Final Four players by adding two of the Elite Eight players. So I do actually have two of the Chris Pauls. I can throw those in there and get myself a Final Four player if I want to. I still actually need to complete the curry from the round of eight. So in order to do that, now I do have the brackets and everything that I need to actually complete that, but I don't know if I want to do it necessarily. Um, I'm thinking that I probably should just so that I can get all of the players to the final four round. But the problem is that if I do that, I'm spending what it's going to cost me 20 of my brackets and I would have to pull those out of the ones that I have over there for like the Ewing and the Leitner currently so I would be really down there only being able to pick from like maybe one of the players to complete for the final four version uh, unless they give us better options for completing them um, with sets and things like that over the next couple of days so I'm kind of waiting to, to, to figure out what I want to do regarding that I haven't decided yet but that's kind of the situation. Now, what I also am going to do today, guys, and along, I know this has been a little bit of a ranting video and things like that. But um, what I am going to do today is actually open up the round of four packs that they have in the game. So the player packs, here they are, elite round of four elite players. You can do those with uh, points or you can get yourself the round of four pack. Now, the round of four pack is going to guarantee you uh, four gold or elite Madden mobile or Madden mobile mobile madness players and four additional gold or better players. So these are very, very expensive, 150,000 coins each. Now, these do give you an upgraded chance of having one of the elite players from one of the rounds. So that's why we're going to try and open it up. Um, it does give you an increased chance at players from the round of Final Four. So this is why we're trying to do it. We want to get one of those uh, elite round of four players. If we do that, we're making our coins back like four or five times almost. So this is really the move if you're really ready to risk it for the biscuit, I guess. <laughs> but uh, here we go, guys. Let's open up these two packs here. The round of four packs. Hopefully we get something beastly, man. Let's go. Come on. And we completely miss, of course. Damn it. Oh, man, that's not good. These packs are so expensive that you pretty much have to hit. Otherwise, it's just a massive loss. 300,000 coins on two packs. These things are very, very expensive, guys. We'll go slowly through this one. Maybe we'll have better luck if you do that. Let's go from the back, actually. Willie Reed, Marcus Spates. Come on, man. Rudy Gay. Come on. Damn it. We really just need one. Just need one, and we get a Seth Curry randomly, but that is not going to do it for us. So we do strike out, unfortunately, on these packs. Man, that is bad luck. That sucks. Oh, well. Well, guys, hopefully you did enjoy the video. Hopefully you learned something, and hopefully you guys will be able to get more of the players and the collectibles and things that you need to complete your final four players and then eventually your championship round players. Let me know in the comment section below, guys, if you have any suggestions as far as how to get more of those or anything like that. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you're new, and I will talk to you guys again soon.